All right, so we're going to look at the new FaceTime feature that was introduced today uh, for the Mac. And so I have an iPhone 4 here, and I've got a Mac running Snow Leopard. I've already downloaded the beta, which is you can get online right now from Apple. Uh, so once you install the beta, what you have to do is register it with your email address, OK? Uh, that's the email address that you use for your iTunes account, OK? That refers you to yourself, if that makes any sense. So my MacBook is on Wi-Fi, and my iPhone is also on Wi-Fi. If I hack the iPhone and put it on uh, 3G unrestrictor or what have you, then I can do this over 3G. But for now, we're doing this over Wi-Fi, both in the same network, although, again, that doesn't need to be the case. So I'll just dial um, my email address from here. So now it's actually calling FaceTime. And now there's a new request here. So I'll hit Accept. And so now what you see on the phone here is now I've got myself and there's my camera and the whole setup, right? So now um, we'll look at the screencast here and we can see this. There's quite the echo, which of course, because I'm in the same room. But uh, you can kind of see how that's working. So if I rotate the phone, the computer rotates itself as well. And then um, I think I can go full screen. There we go. All right, so now I'm actually going full screen. That's awesome. Uh, again, I can rotate it back. The phone recognizes. And if I end the call, now I get my entire list of people. So I'll come down here, and I will call myself to call the phone. So I'll just call my phone number. And so now I've got nothing. And now I'm getting a FaceTime call from myself from the computer. So I'll just accept that call. And now I'm going to come back to the FaceTime call again. So that's basically, uh, yeah, don't do this in the same room. I don't recommend it. Uh, but that's basically how you would do FaceTime with your Mac.